Hey everyone, it's your girl Twin D and thank you for stopping by my channel. I have news for you. I have news for you from your masculines. <laughs> Let's jump right in you guys. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Okay, guys, let's see what's going on with these masculines. And if you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe. And, guys, thank you so much for subscribing, liking, and sharing. You're just helping me to reach twin flames. That's what I want to do, reach all the twin flames in this world. Is that possible? I have no idea. But let's see. <laughs> Okay, guys, let's jump in and see what's going on with your masculines. Vanity. So this vanity is regarding to things around these masculines that aren't serving him. That's of no good to your masculine. We're going to find out what's going on with that vanity. Anything else, what's going on with these masculines, please? Yep, renewal and expansion. So they're gaining strength to change things in their life, to change their past, to get rid of things that no longer serve them things that aren't important to them, people, places, and things. Bringing forth a brand new life, brand new soul, brand new mind, brand new heart. Connecting to God, getting information, because only God can change you. You can try to change all you want, but if you don't let God into your life and allow him to guide you on the right path and and show you the right direction, change. It's like it's impossible. An expansion, expressing his feelings, expressing his emotions, getting downloads from God so he can express himself, finding himself, which is why there is a renewal there. Anything else, please? Ah, just saw one, 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 and zero, one, ten. Reflecting numbers. These masculines and feminines are definitely reflecting each other. Rejection. See, rejecting every and anything that does not serve him. This is my life. This is not what you want it to be. That's what a masculine is telling somebody. I make my own decisions. Doesn't matter what I've learned. It matters what I want. Three, three, three. Again, that's about connecting to spirit. And the facade, put, putting away the facade of his life, wearing the mask, trying to make things seem a way that they're not. He's trying to renew himself. That's it. He's trying to renew himself. He's thinking about changing, planning on changing his life. Planning on finding his path. On the bottom of the deck is growth. Look. All these cards just, it's just confirming each other here. Growth, expansion, confirming growth, growth, ex confirming expansion. This facade, putting it away, confirming the renewal and the vanity, getting rid of all those things that doesn't serve him. This rejection card is just confirming that. His heart is opening up, his mind, his soul.
Let's see what else I can get here. Let's see his energy. What are these masculine's energy right now? The thinking man just popped out. What I'm doing here is just my little pre-shuffle, guys. Clearing the energy. Energy of the cards. Okay. What else is going on with these masculines, please? There you go. Thinking about his contract, his destiny, his life path. Making things balance. Making his life balance. No time for foolishness anymore. No time for vanity anymore. It's time to reveal the truth. It's time to look at all the things that I've learned. It's time to go back to my past life, my love. There you go. He has a decision to make. He has a decision to make. And that decision is going to be very important in his life because it's going to depend on him being renewed, change a new person. And then you have the second chakra, which is getting and knowing his self-worth. The way that he's feeling, the passion that he has for this past life relationship. And this is a 36, 9 completion of a cycle. So this decision has ended. Whatever the, guess this vanity here has ended. Whatever was distracting him has ended. And now it's time for him to be renewed. Knowing his self-worth. Knowing what he's worth. Making that big decision to change change for the better what else is happening the garden and the gate they're breaking free expanding breaking free stop being scared of the new stop being scared of change look what's popping up happy family happy life this is a change that's awaiting him. He's scared. But that's ending. That's what he's moving forward to. And blossom in abundance. Moving forward to his blossom in abundance because he has rejected every and anything that does not serve him. Oh, I love this reading already. The sun card. He is so happy. You see all that yellow? He is so happy. So happy. It's like, I am a man now. Oh my gosh, he's so happy because, look, 516, this past life relationship that he's been thinking about. This woman that he's changing for, that he has found a new appreciation for, because this person does appreciate him more than anyone from his past. Anyone from his roots, maybe his family, people who are trying to control his life. But that's it. On the bottom of the deck is strategy. So he's definitely going to have to find a way to get around this, to move towards this person that he, he now appreciates to the fullest. What else is going on here with these masculines? What is going on with these masculines, please? The Hierophant. Oh, connecting to spirit. Connecting to spirit for insight. 
I mean, that's it. He's trying to strategize, so he, he, he has to be thinking and asking God for help. Guide me, God, guide me. Look at how this man's holding on to, I don't know who that is, their hands. Like asking for guidance, bless me, help me. I need your guidance. I need this blindfold to come off my eyes so I can clearly see what's going on around me. I need to make the right decision. Did a card fall out? Yes, king of swords. He has clarity. He has clarity about everything now, about his life. Again, the books. Books are here. He's gaining knowledge and the scale that will cause balance in his life. And here he is sitting with the truth because he has gained clarity from the knowledge that he has gained from God. What else? Mm -hmm. He's gained clarity about his wish. About his wish, this person that he appreciates so much. It's like he's just sitting there looking. Oh my God, you're so beautiful. Oh my God, I can't believe you're mine. Oh my God, I can't believe I didn't move forward to you. Oh my God, you're just so beautiful. Oh my God, you're my star. Oh my God, you're my wish. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> oh my God, that's just how he feels about you. Because this man's now the emperor. And the way that he feels about you. Oh my God. You give him that strength. You give him that power. You gave him the strength to change, to be a new person, to transform, to put away everything in his life that doesn't serve him. And then you have the Ten of Pentacles. Happiness. Wishes being fulfilled. That's what he sees in you. And tens are all about an ending for a new beginning. So all of that is ending so this divine masculine can have his new beginning with you. There he is. Nine of Wands. Transforming. Communicating putting up a defense, defending his heart, defending his soul, defending everything that he has worked for. Anything else you want to tell me about what's going on with these masculines? Anything else? The sun. The sun, the sun card showed up already in the bottom of the deck. Not on the bottom, but it was on the bottom of the energy deck. The sun, as I was saying about transformation, he's so happy, as I said before, you make him so happy. You brighten up his life. You transform this man. They feel so transformed. This is him. Transforming from something that wasn't him, his life that wasn't his. He was a, I don't know, he, doesn't, he didn't even know himself. He didn't even know what he was, but now he has transformed. He has transformed to that emperor. He has transformed to that emperor. Being strong, courageous, being a man, speaking his truth. Like, listen, woman. I want to speak my truth to you. Listen, and listen good. I've been through so much. I've looked deep within for answers, and I found them, and I, I, you're going to listen to me now. Okay, baby. Speak your truth. 
What do you want to say, honey? <laughs> what do you want to say, honey? <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, come on. <laughs> honey, what do you want to say? Speak. Speak, honey. What do you want to say? You are at a crossroads. That's the big decision that you had to make. Okay, so what else? You what else? Oh, the star. Wish fulfillment, oh my God. The wishes are coming through. Wishes are coming through. This is the star again. That's his wish, his lady, the divine feminine. The divine feminine is his wish. That's the decision that he has to make, his wish fulfillment, or what? Don't change or change and move towards my wish fulfillment, which is my divine feminine. I think he's made his decision. Because mm -hmm. look. The bear showed up. The bear showed up. That is being strong. It's like the strength card. What else, Divine Masculine? What else do you want to say, baby? I won't stop you, baby. What else do you want to say? I listen. <laughs> oh my gosh. The garden and the stork. This is a garden, it's like the community card where people come together to celebrate something. And I think people are going to come together to celebrate this new beginning. This newness, this renewal. Seven and one, eight, abundance. The abundance that's coming in between both of you. So maybe marriages, commitments, engagements, babies. This change is going to be something that's, that, that brings forth something new. Something new in both your lives. There's 17 on my card and I'm at 17 minutes. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes, believers. Oh, yes, believers. He comes from the glory. He comes from the glorious kingdom. What did I say? What did I say? Commitment, marriages. That's the ring. Feminines are already getting their rings. I guess there's more feminines that are getting their rings because it showed up again. It showed up again. And what did I say about the marriage and the new beginning? And here you have the ring. That's a new beginning. That's a new beginning. What else is going on here? What else is going on with these masculines, please? Again, look, the indecision card showed up. The indecision card showed up. We already know that that's done with. Now, these masculines have something to change. A career change is coming up for you or the divine masculine. That's going to help you to grow, both of you to grow together. So finances are going to increase. Finances are going to increase. Maybe more than one job is going to come up for you guys that you're going to have to choose from. You are here for a reason. You are here for a reason. It's time to be renewed. But wake up to your purpose, your reason. You can't run from this. You are here for a reason and you cannot run from it. So don't try. Do not try. Look. True love, you cannot run from this true love. You can't run. Don't try to run. You'll just be pulled right back in. Don't try to run. Romans angels, give me some, 
Give me some blessing cards for these masculines and feminines, please. Attraction. Oh, come on. Come on. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Enjoy yourself, your newfound self, divine masculines. Retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. Yup, it's time to disconnect and start to connect with God, with yourself, your inner self, knowing what you are worth. It's time to grab your feminine and say, let's go, baby. Come on, woman. <laughs> Forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moment. So all these things that didn't serve you, that people try to control you, you have to forgive. So forgive them and move on so you can heal your present. Because there's something new coming in for you. A new love, a new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Your new love is coming in for you. Forgive and move away. Let's get you some angel messages. This is Keepers of the Light. Commander Ashtar, call to action. Take charge, lead by example, walk your talk. There you go. Walk your talk. Sanat Kumara, light activation. Shine your light. Your internal guidance is coming through loud and clear. There you go. That's why you are renewed divine masculines. Masculines. A new person. Peace. Peace comes from remembering that only love is real. All that vanity. Look, this facade and vanity. That's not real. That's not real. Only love is real. And the gifts from God, Archangel Sandalphon. We angels bring you gifts from your Creator. Open your arms to receive divine feminines. Divine feminines. Clear audience. Notice the loving guidance you hear inside your mind and from other people. Take note, please. Take note. Take note. Guys, this has been your message. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell so you are notified whenever I post new messages. Take care of yourselves, everyone. Love you all. Bye.